इस दुर्घटने के शुरुआत पे अगर हमारी आवाजों को सुनी होती अगर उन्होंने हमारे सीएम के साथ साथ बात की होती और इस दुर्घटना के अन करने के लिए अगर एक बात भी बोला होता तो आज ये दुर्घटना यहाँ तक नहीं पहुँचती उनका जो बेटी बचाओ बेटी पर आओ अभी हमारी बहने हैं हमारे भाई हैं वो पढ़ाई नहीं कर पा रहे हैं इम्फाल पे पढ़ाई चल रही है स्कूलें चल रहे हैं लेकिन ये बेटी पर आओ बेटी पर बचाओ कह रहे हैं हमारी बेटियाँ और इस देश की बेटियों के सामने बलात्कार और हादसा हो रहा है मणिपुर इम्फाल पे पढ़ते हैं आधा से आधा लोग लेकिन आपको इतना बता दें कि वहाँ के बच्चे स्कूल नहीं जा पा रहे प्रधानमंत्री मोदी को ये कहेंगे की आप पहले थोड़ा बहुत शर्म कीजिए शर्म कीजिए प्रधानमंत्री जी क्योंकि इतना जो सेवेंटी मोवर सेवेंटी डेज इशू चल रहा है झगड़ा चल रहा है आप कुछ भी नहीं बोलता है और जो बीरेन्द्र सिंह गवर्नमेंट है वो सब ऑल अक्रॉस द स्टेट ऑल अक्रॉस द कंट्री जो इसको इस्तीफा देने के मांग कर रहा है अभी भी उसका सीट बचाए के रखा है क्योंकि अपना पावर अपना अपना गवर्नमेंट है इसलिए ये शर्म आनी चाहिए और जो बीरेन्द्र सिंह गवर्नमेंट है उसको तुरंत हटाना चाहिए ये बोल रहे हैं कि भाई हम इसको रोकना चाहिए वायलेंस लेना पीस लाना चाहिए ऐसे नहीं है जबरदस्ती से बोलना पड़ेगा भाई क्योंकि जो सेवेंटी डेज जो इशूज चल रहा है उसने बहुत सारा अरे ये तो मामूली इशू है इसलिए कोई भाई पॉलिटिकल जो इंटेंशन उसके पास नहीं था अब तक तो कंट्रोल आउट ऑफ कंट्रोल हो गया है कंट्रोल नहीं कर पा रहा है और जो है जो लगातार चल रहा है और जो मानसून सीजन भी शुरू हुआ है और पूरा देश एकता हो के जो बीजेपी गवर्नमेंट का जो फेलियर है उनको सामने फिर जो वर्ल्ड के सामने जो दिखाए रह रहे हैं इसके कारण जो उसको मुंह को सेव करने के लिए जबरदस्ती से बोला पड़े इसे बोल रहा है कोई उम्मीद नहीं है um against the incident that has been going viral uh, in the social media which has been circulated in social media the heinous crimes that has been committed in manipur um actually the incident was occurred on 4th may uh, 2023 and after 70 days it was uh, gone viral and now the prime minister who chose to remain silent for more than 2 months has now spoken up and called it as shameful shame on modi government shame on you for choosing to remain silent for more than 2 months when all the all the atrocities has been committed against the people in manipur when the lives has been destroyed the people were being killed houses were being burned down properties were being destroyed and all when all those things were happening he chose to remain silent but the people in manipur and from other parts of the country were asking him to speak up to speak up about the incidents in manipur and regarding the present cm chief minister of manipur people have lost their faith have don't have any trust in him and people has been demanding for his resignation because we condemn the state government in this um the communal violence that has been happening in manipur and regarding the incidents that has been going viral it is a uh, a lot of people from uh, across the country are um condemning such heinous crime and people are demanding for a justice against those perpetrators the government the government is for the people right people they are the representative but the state machinery and those so called and the so called those representatives have failed the people in manipur have failed the women in manipur have failed the laboring classes in manipur so they should be held accountable because after it, 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 the, the, the the violence has been going more than 2 months so the government should have resolved it in time but things are going out of hand but despite being said this it doesn't mean that we don't have any hope it is only the priority see it is not uh, we can't deny the fact that the urgent matter in this state it should be the violence that has been happening in manipur but despite this fact he chose to ignore he he turned blind eye to this incident and that should be the urgent matter that should be the that should be the top priority because people are being killed as i have said so when all the all the things have been unfolded all the heinous crimes are being committed the atrocities against those women he only now chose to speak up so shame on you modi government shame on the present cm manipur but this, um, we want justice 
until and unless we get the justice for those victims, we will not stop fighting for it.